Hi, my name is Charlotte Fate. My video submission was of my solo. I competed at the Radix Regionals competition back in April, and that was in Santa Clara. And that was my solo in the contemporary category titled Pancakes for Dinner. I will be continuing my studies at the University of South Florida and majoring in architecture. And I will also be on the Sundolls dance team where we compete at the NDA competition in Daytona Beach, Florida. And we also do football games, basketball games, and community events. Thank you so much. Hi, so this video is of me doing a variation from the Ballet Paquita in a ballet competition called Youth American Grand Prix, um, and I'm really, really proud of it. I've really struggled with how I look on stage and watching this video back. I've honestly never felt proud of a, a ballet performance that I've ever done before, so um, yeah, so that's why I turned this one in, and I'm really thankful for the opportunities that it has given me. Um, and I look forward to attending Loyola Marymount University in the fall for uh, being a dance major so I can, um, I can continue uh, dancing and getting more performing um, opportunities as well. A um, big part of my life is Disney and um, they've definitely got plenty of ties with Disney over there. Um, so I'm really excited to hopefully further my uh, experience in my future with becoming a performer for Disney, the company, um, Disneyland, Disney World, Disneyland Paris, I don't know, <laughs> we'll see where life takes me, but parades, shows, what have you, I'm just really, really excited to hopefully do that. Katie Kuvlin, Paquita. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hi everybody, I'm Julianne and I'm a 2022 recipient of the Zona Murray Arts Scholarship. Um, I'm so honored to be here today and to have the opportunity to enjoy this award and I just thank you all so much. Um, so my pieces are a painting, a watercolor painting of turtles that I made um, and this is one of my favorite paintings because I made it for my dad as a Father's Day present um, and so I love sharing that memory. Um, my second piece is a graphite sketch of a treehouse that I imagined in, from my Art 2 class and that was probably one of my favorite art projects I've ever done. And the third and final one is a pastel sketch of some flowers from my garden. And my garden and my house is one of my favorite places in the entire world. So I'm just that serves as a memory for me, all the great times I've spent um, in my garden with my family. And I am here today because I want to continue art um, in my post-secondary schooling and throughout my life. And I'm so excited to have that opportunity um, to go to a community college as great as Palomar in San Marcos and to continue on to CSU in the future. And thank you so much. And again, my name is Julianne Littlefield. Hello, my name is Lucas Stapleton. I'm a graduate of Sage Creek High School and a future student of Cal State Los Angeles. I am so completely honored and deeply grateful to be awarded with this scholarship. The arts have always been my deepest passion, so getting to be recognized for that passion in a way that pushes me forward on my journey to pursue the arts is truly wonderful. My submitted piece was recorded for a competition with the National Association of Teachers of Singing, or NATS for short. The three pieces I performed at NATS served as important means of gender and artistic expression for me, as they were all pieces written for females. The piece I submitted for the scholarship is of particular importance for me and is, to me, one of my best performances. I truly hope you enjoy. Thank you. And I'll be singing If Love Were All by Noel Coward from O Coward. Life is very rough and tumble for a humble disses. One can betray one's troubles, never, whatever occurs. Night after night, half the bright, whether you're well or ill. People must laugh their fill You mustn't sleep Till dawn comes creeping Though I never really grumble Life's a jumble indeed And in my efforts to succeed I've had to formulate a creed I believe in doing what I can In crying when I must In laughing when I choose Hey ho, if love were all I should be lonely I believe the more you love a man The more you give your 
trust, the more you're bound to lose. Although, when shadows fall, I think if only somebody splendid really needed me, someone affectionate and dear, cares would be ended if I knew that he wanted to have me near but I believe that since my life began the most I've had is just a talent to amuse hey ho if love were all the like buffets me obscenely it serenely moves on Though I question its conclusion Illusion is gone Frequently I put a bit by Safe for a rainy day Nobody here can say to what indeed The years are leading Though fate often treats me meanly I keenly pursue a little mirror in the blue. Determination sees me through. I believe in doing what I can, in crying when I must, in laughing when I choose. I should be lonely I believe the more you love a man The more you give your trust The more you're bound to lose Although when shadows fall I think if only Somebody splendid really needed me Someone affectionate and dear Cares would be ended if I knew that he Wanted to have me near But I believe that since my life began The most I've had is just a talent to amuse
Though your eyes betray what burns inside you Whatever I feel for you You only seem to care about you Is there any chance you could see me too? Cause I love you Is there anything I could do Just to get some attention from you In the ways I've lost every trace of you this fall for um, a major in studio art. I'm also looking for um, a double major in the cinema and media design program. Um, personally, I'm really interested in modernized design art, so like animation, concept design, anything with really bright cult, um, colors um, in, within entertainment and pop culture um, are pieces that really interest me. Um, I've been a fine artist for quite a few years now. Ever since I was a kid, I've been super into art and creating different things. Um, and I feel that that really reflects in my art um, as my style includes very colorful um, and bright motifs with a lot of like visual interest um, and high saturation viewpoints. Um, so I kind of wanted to talk a little bit little bit about my pieces um both of them the one with the fish and the one kind of re representing um an ode to chinese culture within a, Amer an english um dictionary are very much odes to my own culture and my childhood um i really enjoy putting a lot of um asian appreciation um and culture within my art i'm so proud of being an asian american woman um and I, I just really love to display that in my pieces. That along with food and family values, um, also intrinsic to Chinese and Japanese cultures where food and cooking is very highly valued and um, very important ways to spend family time. Um, a lot of those motifs show up in my paintings a lot. Um, and yeah, that's kind of just a little overview of me and my pieces. I really hope you enjoy them. Um, and thank you so much for the opportunity to be here. Um, I really do appreciate the scholarship um, going towards my art education and um, my future explorations um, at UC Davis. Thank you. <laughs> 